morning guys welcome back to the joy of resin doing a mold pull video for you real quick um so let's see let's just get right into it uh, let's see got a new little skull just the uh <clears throat> what was it white dye with a little bit of a droplet of black dye dipped in there came out pretty cool See, I made some new plugs. With just the leftover dye that I had, or the leftover resin. So, just paint splashes, dye splashes. Just gotta trim those up and polish them. I need to learn how to buff these properly and seal them possibly in a wax or a polish so that I don't have to worry about uh, seepage. Let's see, all right, these are the dice that I tried to repair. So when I was fixing these, I mean, they're still not coming out great because, well, I mean, I just need to get that pressure pot up and running so that I can actually utilize these. But they're a lot better than they were. Still a couple little, um, little, uh, bubble voids in there. But that's, that's as good as I'll be able to make them in the mold. Okay. Hmm. These have micro bubbles in a lot of places. I'm just going to retire this mold. It just don't, it never seems to come out right. This is way more micro bubbling than I would like. Just some very basic black obsidian dice with little hints of gold mixed in there. But you can see all those little micro bubbles. Not a fan. All right, next up we have our latest triangle. That time I said it on purpose. Eep. Edges on this one are always so sharp. Ah, see, just stabbed myself. And not in a fun way. All right, so you can see the kind of swirl of colors we've got going on there. The intention is to just draw the eye down into the depths and I will seat this once again in the orb, except this time I'm going to put in a thin layer of resin first and then get the triangle and pyramid in there and then pour up and around it. So last time I ended up with a void here in the middle that uh, ended up with gave it a very mirrored surface right there in the center. So I'm trying to avoid that this time. And then the last thing we have today is another one of these roses. This one is just black with uh, white resin. I'm thinking, I'm thinking I should have gone with white mica instead of just white resin because this is not going to look like much of anything. But the only true testament is to test it out in uh, in the sunlight. So that is it for today. <clears throat> um, and I'll see you guys again soon.